Assalamu alaikum. In today's tutorial, we will see how to enable view structure after installing XCristen in the system in W2 web interface. Because even if you have XCristen installed in your machine, sometimes W2 web do not recognize it. So, we have to uh, add some, the path of the XCristen to the bash RC file so that w2 wave recognize it so we'll show how to do it first i'll go to w2 wave i'll run it in the terminal then open the link so we have this session let's start a new session titanium carbide so I'll first create the directory titanium carbide i have created it now like directory Okay, this side looks uh, not very nice. So, uh, to make it nice, we will enable the JavaScript. What I will do, you can see now the configuration. You can zoom out. If you cannot see this in your screen, you can zoom out. Control minus by pressing Control minus. Configure. Now, show JavaScript menu. I check this one and save these values and click here. Uh, click for the new setting to take effect immediately. I will click here. Now, if I select you can see I have I can see all these things so I will show you that that so you can see I do not have view structure here even though I have installed X Christian in my system and it's running well but you can see I don't have it in the W2 wave so to enable it uh, just before enabling it let me show how to generate a structure then we will uh, show what it is how to enable it let's go to user guide so this is another problem if you face you just need to link the user guide direct uh, properly so what we can do to get the file uh, the pdf file we go to cd win root in root so this is my root file now i go cd src w2 wav now you can see i have uh, so file i go to this one ht docs ht docs this is actually the hyperlink uh, so this one is not working properly so what i'll do i'll remove this one and link the user manual properly so, uh, with the rm user guide i deleted it now i link it to ln minus s so i go two step out so now i am in in this directory now src user guide html so i press enter so it should be ready now okay yeah here it is so let's go to the page 34 i think it should be something 16 or something yes okay i don't know what's happening so here we have the details of for titanium carbide this is f type lattice so let me uh, copy this and put the uh, generate the structure here so two atom i will select two atom now this is f type titan title titanium carbide and the parameters are so this is just uh, i'm copying from here it's given in the user guide so this is titanium this is carbon this is 0 0.5 0 0.5 0 0.5 now i save it um, need to create rmt let's do it as it is so save clean now I have the structure I have generated. So if I go here, CDW, then titanium carbide, I can see that I have the files. I don't, I cannot see this here. So to see the view structure here, what I need, I need to add the path of XCristen to the system. For that, you can, uh, it can be done manually, but you can download this script uh, from the script. This one, install XCristen and enabling view structure uh, if your system has xcristen already it will just uh, enable the view structure if you do not have xcristen it will install it 
of course this is for ubuntu for other system otherwise you may need to uh, edit the script or do it manually so i right click on it and save link as i'll save it in home just need it once so uh, i'm in the home so let's see so this is the script i need to make it executable now i run the script so it says now to execute this one so it is uh, added it says and now i run w2 wave again okay let's go back here i need to refresh it the view is now i you see i have the view structure uh, uh, option here if i click it shows the structure so this is uh, to add the view structure uh, so sorry to enable the view structure option in the w2 wave that's all for today thank you